Woods' State Farm assist of the game. And definitely deserving of the prize tonight. How about the read he made here? Looking like a point guard putting the pass right on the money. So Whoa. helpful to the offensive versatility when your bigs can create freeing everybody up and that cut. So it's the Nuggets winning this one easily. And in the win, a comfortable win in what was, I think, G, a pretty hostile environment. It, it really was. You, you know, it's never going to be easy on the road, but they didn't have too many problems with that tonight. And that's going to do it tonight, folks, for our broadcast. So for David Aldridge, Greg Anthony, Brent Berry, and the whole 2K Sports crew, this is Kevin Harlan thanking you for being with us. So long and good night, everyone. Yep, I go with this, man. All right. Yeah. champions back to the 2k tv awards they're next week uh. it's the 2k sports pregame show okay basketball fans with me kenny the jet smith shaquille o'neal i'm ernie johnson you're watching 2k sports but you know that already tonight we'll see the denver nuggets playing against the los angeles oh, lakers at cool. staples center looking at the lakers they split the season series against these guys last season, two games apiece. Should be a good one tonight. And already the grind of the new season starting to show. Shaq, how do you stay fresh for the long haul, both uh, as a player and as a just a massive individual? Veteran guys, you got to know how to pace yourself. And minute restrictions, you know, it, it really has become a bigger part of the game. Yeah, I agree. So, you know, injury histories always taken into account now. This is why you have to develop depth. How do you stay fresh for the long haul? Oh, man, I have this drink I put together. Oh, really? What is it? Oh, yeah, it's a little, like, I take tomatoes, right? And I squish them up, and it gets, to, and it gets real, like, tomato sauce. Uh -huh. And I put that in. And then I take uh, kale salad. I put uh -huh. that in. What are you I making, put spaghetti? Ginger. I put ginger in it. Yeah. Put that in. I put a little cayenne pepper in. Sounds, and a little bell pepper. Ernie. Sounds disgusting. Ernie, he's, he's making lasagna over there. Sounds disgusting. Can I get some of your man. lasagna? Oh, man, it's, it's a pepper. It makes you... Pep up. Yeah, that'll do it for us. Thanks for tuning in. Also give Let's go. 2K Sports welcomes you to the following presentation of the NBA. Let's go, babe. Thank you. 
Can't step up, man. Ball. Can't step up, man. It's game time in Los Angeles from the Staples Center. All the crowd ready to go as they look to cheer on the Lakers. This is Kevin Harlan along with Greg Anthony and Brent Berry. David Aldridge will be reporting from the sidelines. So for the Lakers, their last game a win against the Suns in Phoenix. And to say the least, it was a neck and neck type game, but they finally pulled it out in the second overtime. Yeah, I mean, nobody saw that game going to overtime, much less double overtime. Yo, right? and, and then also to get the victory, wow. Tip-off goes to Denver. Up, We've already checked in for Los Angeles. So on the floor for Denver. Inside, it's the talented pair of Millsap and Jokic. Harris and Barton, the two wings. And it's Murray in at the point guard position. The pass to Millsap. Shoots over Kuzma. And that one's wow. good, Millsap. Millsap's got seven. You can see how comfortable Millsap is right now, his confidence growing. Lakers trail by seven. Here's LeBron. And it's Jokic with the we rebound. And so it's though. Jokic with the ball. He brings it up for always. the Denver Nuggets. Harris passes to Murray. Pass to Jokic over AI. And contact on the I shot. So I didn't even count. Well, with Jokic, even the organization wow. admits when they drafted him, they did not envision this kind of production. I mean, really has been off the charts. You think about the trade that they made to clear the way for Jokic to be the defined center and what he's done with that. This team has been off to the races offensively with the way he handles the point center position. Now, here's AI. And AI throws it down. And didn't do anything fancy there, but didn't need to. Nope. He, his only concern right now is getting the points on the board. And I, I don't mean style points. And here are the Nuggets now after the basket by the Lakers. Murray kicks to Jokic, and he makes good on the layup. Six points wow, for him. Uh, like that from Murray right there. When he's passing please. it like this, it can make him so much better and so much more open. Harris against Harris. Here's AI. Fouled yes. in the act of shooting. Gets the bucket anyway, so a three-point play chance for him. And that is one thing he does very well. His intensity on the glass helps lead to these high percentage putbacks for his team. First trip to the free throw line for him tonight. He struggled mightily at the free throw line in their last game. I know. Free throw, no good for AI. An exciting team in Denver these days, and their fans are letting them know it. Yeah, they're starting to get fired up in Denver. The arena sold out 14 times last year, compared to just three times the year before. So for decades, this has been a football town. Uh, Nuggets starting to garner some attention with the type of roster and the way that they play. Here's LeBron after the Nuggets pick up two. Here's AI. 
No good on that one. Good defense by Jokic. The Nuggets leading by nine. Pass to Barton. Good, and the assist goes to Murray. And already with the commanding lead, a terrific offensive performance. And if you check out the strategy, you can see already the plays that they're calling. Feels like they found a weakness or two in the defense. Here's Ball after the basket by Will Barton and stolen by Harris. Murray left side, and he's fouled pretty hard on that shot, but he's got the chance to pick up the points at the line. Anzo Ball picks one up. I like that penetration there. Murray getting to the cup with great quickness. Well, Jamal Murray, you, you can't start much younger than Jamal did at age three. He reportedly could play basketball for hours on end. Where's the nap time, Kevin? That's what, where is the nap time? Ajan Rondo is checked in for the Lakers. Now, here's AI. A 23-point game for him in the win against Phoenix. Just five to shoot. James finds Harris. Floats it up for AI. Whoops, there's the 24-second shot clock violation, so they'll turn it over. And checking out the stats for Jokic. Last oh season, God. he played outstanding. Ninth in rebounding. And his passing skills were on full display all day? year. He ranked that among the top 15 in assists. He was a top 10 rebounder last season for good reason. He's an incredibly intense guy to compete with. And, uh, and, and for a full game, too. I mean, just nonstop. And that one, good. There really isn't a time in Murray's life that he wasn't great at this game. No, in Canada, just such a, a great career in Ontario. Played alongside, actually, Thon Maker. And then one year at Kentucky. Who, who doesn't have one year at Kentucky? Drafted seventh overall. And, and what a, an amazing fit that uh, he's still pointing up and improving. One of the game's more deadly shooters right now. Looking at who's out there now for the Lakers. Ingram comes in for Kyle Kuzma. And it's Contavious Caldwell Pope in for Harris. Denver also making some changes. Plumley comes in for Paul Millsap. And Morris subbed in for Murray. Here's Jokic following the basket by LeBron James. Jokic draws the double. And we're going to have a jump ball. It's tied up there. Wow, man. Wow, yeah. And here are the Nuggets now. Morris against Rondo. Morris looking over the floor. Over LeBron. And the rejection by James. Nice. Uh, LeBron using his big mitts there. Comes in handy on defense. Getting up there to spike that one away. And they force the shot clock violation. Nice. Great D. And just who is providing all the playmaking here tonight? Let's look at the breakdown between the front and back court for the Nuggets. Well, you love to see your front court that really is so gifted with the ball. Great vision, court awareness. They have been a major part of the offensive flow in this game, and what a luxury to have bigs that can pass. Now, here's Caldwell Pope. James dishes to Ingram. Shot clock at six. And the call on the shot that sends him to the line. And Caldwell Pope, the Georgia product, when he's on the floor, it's for his defense. Can give you a handful of points, but what he takes away with defense is far more significant. One of the better perimeter defenders since entering the league. Well, they depend on him to score, and that doesn't mean just from the field. Sometimes it comes from the charity strike. Ingram against Morris. To the paint, it's tipped. And the ball travels out of bounds. It was last touched by Rondo. And with Caldwell Pope and his defense, he can guard any type of perimeter player. Yeah, I mean, has the long arms to bother small wow, forwards and fast feet to Pretty stay with shot, point guards. Man. Really gives the lineup a lot of options in terms of matchups when he's on the floor. Great instincts on defense and is very hard to shake as he'll hound you through screens. Here's LeBron. Following the basket by Mason Plummer, the drive by James. That's not a pretty thing. LeBron James driving right at you, full speed, and when he gets into the lane and towards the rim, he's going to make contact. And he can't make the wow. second free throw either, missing both. So much speculation last season on 
where LeBron would end up. The theories of which team would get his services seem to change hour by hour, especially during free agency. And the Lakers making a change here. Chandler's checked in. Lakers trail by 13. Ingram outside. Back to Rondo. Inside. B.I. passes to Rondo. Back to A.I. Lakers working the ball around now. Played in with a nice touch off the glass. A.I.'s got six. With LeBron, whenever he becomes eligible to change teams, it is the news in the NBA. And rightfully so. This is the best player in the game, and whatever team he ends up wow. with instantly becomes a contender. Been what to eight straight NBA what finals. You would think the teams getting him are thinking a ninth one would sound good to them. The drive by Rondo. The shot, no good. Lovely with some nice D. Here's Porter. And he floats in for the easy two. Credit the assist on that one. And their offense already in a flow. Some stellar shooting to jump out to this lead. It's Ingram on the wing. Guarded by Porter. Umley with a steal. That was my fault. Inside. And Jokic slams it in. Yeah, pounding it inside once again. They have taken over this game physically. Well, it's so nice to have the early lead. This is where you want to stick with what's working until somebody shuts you down. And the Lakers have possession. After the Nuggets pick up two. Rondo passes to AI. Yep, that one goes in there. He's got eight. Yeah, there's no excuse right there for not covering one of the guys on the floor. And that's Rondo around the rim where he can score. Now here's Porter. 11-point game is last outing. Some solid defense from Ingram. Lakers trail by 15. To the middle. What of Out of bounds as the Nuggets gain possession. And now here's the 2K leaderboard with the teams that last season scored the most second chance points in the NBA. The Lakers second. The Nuggets third. And this is a battle today between two teams that really dominated the offensive glass a year ago. And, and they also convert when they get those second chance opportunities. And Plumley kicks to Morris. Jokic on top over AI. And Jokic with the basket on the assist by Morris. And that's 12 points for Jokic. And it's Rondo with the ball for the Lakers. Trailing by 17. Chandler scanning the floor. Back to Caldwell Pope. To the middle. Umley with a steal. Here's Beasley. Softly drops in the floater. Beasley's got his first basket of the night. Yeah, the chemistry has been terrific. Really impressed with their offensive execution. Rondo kicks to Ingram. Caldwell Pope outside. Lock at six. Down low. Here's AI. Fouled on the shot and picks up two points. So one free throw coming up. Yeah, becoming better at setting up his teammates. And uh, yeah. KCP delivers right. that pass on target. Los Angeles shooting their sixth attempt at the charity stripe in the game. Now Thomas. Pass to Jokic. Over AI. And again, it's Denver. Aggressive what can coming I do, out man? of the gate here, guys. Wow. And what already the lead is significant. Excellent play on both ends. And so it's Denver holding a big 18-point lead to close the quarter. Their strategy has been clear tonight. What can I do? It's been a non-traditional basketball journey for AI. He talks about his time playing in China. Before coming to the NBA, I knew I had a lot of growing to do. You know, not just in my game, but who I was as a person as well. Um, playing in China wasn't the typical path here, but it's exactly what I needed in, in that time in my life. So there's some great basketball being played over there, and I wouldn't be surprised to see more of that talent come over to the NBA. 
And AI was the first to follow this path, but now, Greg, that the trail has been blazed, we could see many more. And basketball is such a global sport and played in so many countries that it was just a matter of time before a story like AI's happened. And so far through one quarter, it's been a lopsided game. We'll see if that changes here in the second. And for the Nuggets, this has been the game they wanted to have. The chemistry through the roof, uh, and it's allowed them to build this huge lead after one. All parts are working together, even the guys who have not put the points on the board making their subtle contributions. And a chance here presented by Gatorade to see who's on the floor, all fueled up and ready to go for the start of the second quarter. Taking a look at Los Angeles. Rondo and Caldwell Pope in the backcourt. AI is out there with Chandler, and it's Stevenson in its small forward. That's a surprise. I mean, really out of character for him to miss when the defense no, is not right no, on the We've got an update here, so let's catch up with David Aldridge. Well, guys, Paul Millsap is an all-star forward whose dedication to the game is reflected in his year-to-year -year improvement. He said, the drive to the gym is where I find my peace, getting my mind prepared. I come with the mindset of getting better. It's gotten me this far. Kevin? He is a true professional. David, thank you. And that one's good. AI. They're finding lanes to the hoop now with consistency. Five buckets in a row from the paint. Thomas against Rondo. And Jokic with the basket on the assist from Thomas. And that's 18 points for Jokic. And how about the performance we're seeing from him? Not one miss on the day. To the inside. AI can't hit. They have been board dominant in this game. That's definitely been a fact. Thank you. Take me out. Well, Isaiah Thomas met with a lot of teams in free agency before deciding on the Nuggets. And it just wasn't a great market for IT after coming off such Come a rough season. Had to settle for a short-term deal to show he could still be an impact player. Free throw, good. Jokic. And for Jokic, just keeps getting better, Brent, but always stays very grounded in terms of his personality. Yeah, I think his brothers had a lot to do with that. You just don't see the big ego coming out of him. In fact, you see a guy wow, who's enjoying the game. He smiles, he's laughing with teammates, he enjoys being with this group and around this coaching staff. And he went as far as to say that he plays every game as a game of pickup basketball in his hometown. I, I need to travel over there and get in that game. To the inside, Jokic Ooh. with the steal. Morris kicks to Millsap. The pass to Murray. Here's Jokic. He's covered by Ingram. Jokic, Thank you. No Finally me. Got to make those shots. Not sure how Do he missed man. it. The defense was just okay. Ball against Morris. And off the front iron, and in it goes. I, I'm a fan of how Ball uses that size inside. Excellent at getting his shot off close to the basket. Here's Jokic. Offensive rebound. No. Millsap. Count it. No, no five why? For this game. He's now 5 of 11. And they keep hammering away at him inside, forcing the ball into the paint. Pass to Kuzma. Ingram outside. LeBron passes to A.I. Thank you. No Jeez. stopping him there. Jams it in as he's fouled. That's now for a three-point play. It's on Gary Harris. Contavious Caldwell Pope. He's checked in for Los Angeles. Rondo comes in for Lonzo Ball. Mind the lanes. Mind the lanes. One shot. Free throw. No good for AI. Brent, we're seeing shorter training camps. Uh, I don't know if it adds to injuries or takes away from injuries with fresher bodies. What do you think about that whole philosophy? I believe that the shorter training camp did lead itself and lend itself to more injuries last year. And one of the yes. things that I'm concerned with, Kevin, just on a physiological level for players, is that what they are doing to prepare themselves for the season as an individual player working on your weaknesses and doing those sort of things is not the same as getting in the training camp and preparing yourself for your, your stamina, your endurance, and your win. 
And I wonder if there will be some moves in the next couple seasons Thank about Thank trying you. to get off the individual training and get back to more of the endurance stamina training so that these little injuries are just not part of a season in the future. Wait, wait, Down low, here's Jokic. I was right there. I was right there. I was right, right there. Spinner, and it is good. Jokic has got eight points here in this quarter. Lakers trail by 13. How you Rondo doing that? to Caldwell Pope. You look through the ground. What you doing? Passes it to wow. Come on, I got you, man. James finds Caldwell Pope. Back to James. And here's AI. Yes, it's James that. picking up the assist. I think AI's got that's 19 time, points. Though. Timely passing leads to assists, and that's been the recipe for success. Morris dishes to Millsap. And it's Contavious Caldwell Pope with the foul. That's his first foul of the game, and the bonus will go to the free throw line. Hey, you look at Paul Millsap's career and just how much has changed from being the wow. role player in Utah and scoring wow. in the basket this to becoming guy, part of that him, great bro. run in Atlanta where he expanded his game to the three-point line. Now that scoring and that rebounding is a huge part of what they need here in Denver. From 18 feet away, and with that, Thank the you. Denver lead is cut down to 12 on the bucket from LeBron. And now he's taken a solid opening in the quarter and built on it here in the second. Millsap kicks to Morris. It's Jokic top of the key. Pass to Murray. Five on the clock. To the paint. Takes the 13-footer. LeBron with the block. And it goes down two points. And it's now 26 points for Jokic. Plus wow. eight in the rebound differential. One more reason why they're in control. And talking Millsap, you really do know what you're going to get from him year in and year out. Yeah, it's super consistent. And it goes beyond the stats. He plays with great passion. He's tough. He wants to win basketball games, and that desire shows up every night. The interesting thing is about Paul Millsap being a carrier for this ball club. It's a role he's still getting used to. Here's Murray. And the rejection by James. Nice. Give it back to James. And now James Duncan. pushing it up. Yeah, no way back to stop him. LeBron James out sprinting up the floor. His 16th season still getting after it. The Nuggets leading by 12. LeBron on fire, yes. Give it to the king. Murray surveying the D. Kicks it to Millsap. I got to do my job, man. I got to do my job. I got to do my job. Millsap misses. Los Angeles has gone one or two on three pointers here in the second quarter so far. Caldwell Pope with a wide open look. Great look there, but off target. Leave it to LeBron. Don't shoot the ball. And it's Rajon Rondo with the foul. That's his first foul of the game, and the bonus will go to the free throw line. The Nuggets have been shooting right around 75% at the line, 9 of 12 so far. Nikola Jokic firing on all cylinders for the Denver Nuggets. His work on the glass was outstanding in that quarter. Great rebounding. And now let's catch up with David Aldridge, who's standing by from the sideline. All right, Dave. Thanks, guys. Thanks so much, Dave, for the great interview. Don't go away, folks. We'll be back for the second half of basketball right after that. No, man. I can't stop him, bro. Okay. And with the second half upon us, we'll find out if this game becomes the route that it's threatening to be. You look at and Los Angeles will go for a different look here. AI is checked in for Chandler. Brandon Ingram comes in for LeBron. Caldwell Pope, he's checked in for Harris. Rajon Rondo is subbed in for Ball. Big group substitution here for Denver. Mason Plumley's checked in for Millsap. Porter comes in for Barton. Beasley's checked in for Harris. And Thomas subbed in for Jamal Murray. The big changes in defensive rules happened right in the middle of your playing days. How did people initially react to those? Well, a lot of guys had three quick fouls, Kevin, because yes, they they're, they're out hand-checking and pushing guys around. And they say, what do you mean I can't do this anymore? I get paid to push guys around. Uh, but after a little while, obviously, guys stepping off and understanding positions on the floor where you could get away with more physical play than you can out in front with 
point guards, obviously, and having refs' eyes on them or down on the block. So out there for the Nuggets right now. Porter is out there with Plumley. Then it's Thomas. And it's Nikola Jokic. And it's Beasley in at the two-guard position. Morris is checked in for Isaiah Thomas. Beasley for three. Hits the three-point bomb. Beasley's got five points so far. And he can smell blood in the water. Excellent finish. Yeah, when your opponent's down and frustrated, this is when you could turn it up. Back to Ronda. No one near him. No good off the front iron. Now that's a shot you got to wow. step up on. Wide open, no coverage. Good shooters don't miss that often. Wow. Down low, Plumley the pass to Morris. And the officials call him for a three-second violation. And checking out the numbers for Ingram. Good season for him last year. Put up about 16 points a game. Five rebounds and four assists. And he's putting in the effort, and you can see him getting better with time. So many little things that you have to learn to grow as a player. He's just going through a bit of that process right now. Caldwell Pope against Beasley. Caldwell Pope outside. From what 10 feet out. No good there. And the Nuggets going the other way. Beasley kicks to Morris. Back to Beasley. Now the pass to Morris. Now Jokic. Don't miss it. He's off on oh that God. one. Thank Great you. defense that time from AI. Inside, Ingram. Good. And it's Rondo who picks up the like assist. It, Rondo's like got it. five assists tonight. Got to see Ingram get going down low. Just another dimension of his game that he continues to develop. Ingram against Barton. Morris outside. Over Rondo. And again, yes. Denver no good. No doubt disappointed with that one. He'd love to have that one back. Yeah, I'd put that play and on repeat. Thank the you. setup was nice. perfect. Just need a better result next time. And of the last Thank six you. baskets, five have come on the interior. This is just smash mouth physical basketball, guys. And after the Lakers landed LeBron, the talk was about if they would add they Kawhi miss, Leonard as well. Ultimately, it didn't Sorry. happen. Lakers want to keep their young guns in the end. And LeBron has said he felt that the team was ready without Kawhi and came to the Lakers because of that youthful core they had in place. Timeout called the Lakers. One of the stories here, Nikola Jokic getting it done today. And they simply have no answer right now for what he's doing to them. He is yeah, making no, them man. pay. Caldwell Pope outside. He kicks to Ingram. AI right side. Pass to Kuzma. Ooh. And he uses the glass on the lane. <laughs> Kuzma's got four points in the quarter. And I need to see some more assertiveness out of these defenders. Passes it to Jokic. Double team. Head me out. The Nuggets have had 15 tries at the line. They've made 10. And he can't get yeah. the first one. And for a big man, Jokic is more than just a good free throw shooter. He is fantastic. Yes. No good on the second free throw. This is an unselfish group here in Denver. This team, Brent, can really pass that the ball. A fifth overall last year in the sixth, second man. overall the year before that. And you got to give credit to Mike Malone and his coaching staff because you know, what they've done is they played Jokic at that point center position, distributing the ball from the top and have guys who Ooh. cut off the ball. So uh, interesting mix of talent using their center as the passer. And so Ooh. it's both. Okay. The Nuggets leading by six. Morris kicks to Jokic. It's Barton on the wing. From the arc, no. good on the three-point shot. Barton's got his second bucket of the night. Defensively, they just look out of sync, not closing out on the threes in time. To the inside, 
And that one's good, AI. <laughs> well, we've seen that movie a few times, haven't we? An easy bucket in the paint. I can get mine, though. Barton surveying the floor. One twenty-nine left to play here on the third, and the wide-open shot from Morris. That's in, coming off the assist from Jokic. Jokic has got his fourth assist in this one. Caldwell Pope outside makes it off the glass. Nice. Yeah, rising to the challenge, KCP often deterred by physical play converts through the contact on that one. Morris with the ball. He's picked up by Rondo. Here's Barton. Oh, I do that. Outside Rondo. Nice ball movement here by the Lakers. Caldwell Pope kicks to Ingram. Rondo passes to Caldwell Pope. Just five on the clock. Over Beasley. That shot by Caldwell Pope, no good. And hard work on the glass. Once again, guys, they put a lot of effort and focus on the backboards. Here's Morris. High arcing shot. Come on. It on the How you make that? Morris has got five. Right ah, that floater is a thing of beauty, effective when it's used the right way. Rondo against Morris. Rondo drives in. And Rondo's speed right there, a big help on that play. He uses it well to knife in there, get inside, pick up a foul. Balls, the man. Lakers have made seven of their last 12 attempts at the line. The team just cannot get into a groove from the free throw line. It's a common problem for them. Yeah, you can't shoot. Morris with the ball. Pass to Jokic. And it's Rajon Rondo with the foul. Rondo, what? So that will be his second foul of the game. We're in the bonus, and we'll go to the line to shoot two. Free throw, good. Jokic. That's also good. So he hits both free throws. And so it's the Denver Nuggets holding on to an 11-point cushion as we get ready to take a break. They've played the better game so far, but their work is far from over. And don't go away. We'll be right back. Wow. Come on, baby. Let's do this, man. Let's win this game. And while we can now, let's take a look at today's State Farm assist of the game. And definitely deserving of the prize tonight. How about the read he made here? Looking like a point guard putting the pass right on the money. So oh, helpful to the offensive versatility when your bigs can create freeing everybody up and that cuts. So it's the Nuggets winning this one easily. And in the win, a comfortable win in what was, I think, gee, a pretty hostile environment. It, it really was. You, you know, it's never going to be easy on the road, but they didn't yeah, have too many on. problems with that tonight. And that's going to do it tonight, folks, for our broadcast. So for David Aldridge, Greg Anthony, Brent Berry, and the whole 2K Sports crew, this is Kevin Harlan thanking you for being with us. So long and good night, everyone. Alright guys, that's it man. Wow. I'll see y'all later.